What's up guys, my name is Michael and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we're going to do another League Code Challenge called Smallest Range 1. Given an array A of numbers, uh, we're going to choose any X with uh, between negative K and uh, K uh, inclusive and add X to whatever for each integer inside this array. That's what we're doing. Then after this process we have another array B. We're going to return the smallest difference between the maximum value of B and the minimum value of B. Okay, so first of all, let's think about this first. Uh, we should get the smallest possible value and the largest possible value. Reason why is because we want to return the smallest possible difference between the maximum value of B and the minimum value of B, right? So regardless, we still need to get the maximum, po the largest value and the smallest value we got to subtract that right so what we're gonna do first is we're gonna create an integer called the smallest and have this equal to the first value and the largest is not going to equal to the first value then we're gonna loop through our array and then compare each value to the smallest and largest so what we're gonna do is uh, not compare we're gonna do um, smallest is going to equal to the minimum of my current value at my array and the current smallest value and largest is going to equal to the maximum of whatever my current value is and largest so this is going to get me my smallest value and my largest value now we got to think about this essentially is we want to return the smallest possible difference between the maximum value B and the minimum value B okay so right now we have the smallest and largest value of a okay so a is the so if I draw a diagram here as you can see here let's say I have a number line and then this is my smallest small and this is my largest value and basically what we want to do is we want to essentially min, uh, return the smallest possible difference between the maximum value of B and the minimum value of B so the smallest so we want the difference between here and here Do you guys get it okay so this is the difference between a right now Currently, this is the difference between if I just take the largest minus the smallest, this would be the difference in A. But what we did here is that to get to B, we had to add, choose any integer x with between negative k and k and add it to each value of A. So now, essentially, is we want to return the smallest possible difference between the maximum value of B and the minimum value of B. So how do I do that? Well. The smallest difference is is actually if you, if you because we added a an x value to a of i for each value and x is between negative k and k essentially is if you take smallest and you add it with this k value and you take largest and you just subtract by this k value let's say I take largest minus k this value is going to be the smallest difference. From here to here is going to be the smallest difference. You guys understand me? So if I take this is going to be largest minus k, so I'll just do large minus k, and that's this value, and this value is going to be small plus k. And that would be the smallest difference. Because if you think about it, if you're if you're just if you want to get the smallest possible difference between the maximum value of B and the minimum value of B, that would be the, that would essentially be it, because that, this would be the smallest difference. If you subtract this value, largest minus k and smallest plus k, that would be the diff smallest difference. Because essentially, is what we did was we added whatever k value uh, x to which is between negative k and k to every value into the array, and the best possible thing is to add k here to the smallest and subtract k from the largest because that would because the x the x 
x's lower bound is negative k, and x's upper bound is k. So if we were to add plus k, this would be the, mm, po uh, the maximum possible value you could add to here. And this would be the minimum between here. So then the distance would be as small as possible. So yeah, that's what we're going to do here. So once we have the smallest and largest, we're going to take smallest and plus equal to k. And largest is going to minus equal to k. Then after that, we are going to return the minimum of 0, because we have to return minimum. Uh, the reason why, because uh, absolute, absolute value issues, right? Largest minus smallest. If it's 0, then yeah, we want to have the absolute value to be this. Essentially, we need minimum, because otherwise, you could have negative distances, and that's not good. Okay, so then this would be, if it's negative, we would just return 0. Okay, we submit it. Okay, I got a wrong answer. What was the issue? What is my issue? Is uh, do, 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 smallest minus equal k, largest minus, largest minus small. Oh wait, uh, max. I think actually. Let me see. No, I'm pretty sure it's min. Yeah, okay, it's max. Uh, the reason why it's max is because uh, if it's negative, we don't want the negative. We want to compare zero and the. Uh, the the difference between it because if it's negative we, we want it to be positive essentially so that's why we do max because we want the positive value if it's negative then we should just return zero so that's why that's why it's uh, max so yeah that's how you do it rate comment subscribe I'll check you guys later I hope you enjoyed this video this is a short video but yeah peace